We bounced back. I don't know, you know, in regards to sports, but I think we're resilient, you know, and uh, when it comes down to it, you know, we just we had a lot of comebacks and, you know, we, we had a lot of runs and we had a lot of tough runs that, that led to success for them. But, you know, to have uh be down, you know, three with, you know, a minute or two minutes left, uh, you know, someone great. But, you know, obviously, I don't, I don't think we did a great job to, to fully help us get over the hump. Jay, what's your what are your thoughts? Yeah, I mean, down three with a minute to go. You just have to fight through it. If you feel like, if we felt like um, we didn't play with boys, you still have to fight through it. Um, I felt like we responded well with the turnovers that we had late. We gave ourselves a chance. We just got to get that rebound and see what happened after that. But other than that, um, we got to play through the turnovers and um, just try to capitalize on the next possession. Guys, talk about the uh, Roman from Santa China. Um, talk about the last possession after Tristan Thompson grabbed the defensive rebound and kicked it out. Um, what do you guys have to do better um, to prevent that from happening moving on to the next game? Yeah, you just said it. Just, you know, we keep harping on it. We keep talking about offensive rebounds. and uh, That's one thing that Tristan Thompson does well. Um, I think we were trying to hold ourselves accountable. We had to take it another level as the playoffs. So we had to take it another level and really lock in on him. Um, as, as all five guys on the court have to be aware of where he, where he is. He's going the hardest. So we just keep making it a main focus for us and move forward and watch film on it and try to capitalize on it. Guys, Mark D'Amico, Celtics.com. With that being said, how frustrating is it that it feels like it's the same thing over and over that's preventing you from getting over the hump to grab a win in this series? Um, it's definitely frustrating, uh, you know, it's definitely tough, you know, especially being out there, you know, we're battling back and uh, every time we're coming close, you know, they get a big office a rebound for a big three and, and um, you know, I, I don't think, you know, obviously that's a, that's one of the reasons why it was tough today, but to, you know, really harp on those key moments, you know, we, we've done a lot more stuff, you know, in order to uh, be behind, you know, and obviously, that just is the, you know, a straw that breaks, you know, the camel's back, you know. And uh, Tristan Thompson's really talented at, at what he does. He's been doing it, you know, all season. But, you know, I think uh, we have a lot of other things we need to do as well. But that, that's definitely something, you know, that, that definitely uh, sends us overboard. Uh, so. What, if anything, do you think is the biggest step forward that you guys took tonight? The biggest step forward we took? I mean, I haven't really looked at the game, but uh, from being out there, we just battled. Uh, they made runs, we made runs, we responded well, I felt like, you know, I think that showed the growth in our group, and because um, the, the game is a game of runs, especially with these guys who have great offense, you know, they're going to make runs, uh, but we just have to respond uh, on both ends of the court when they, when they go on their runs, so I felt like we did a decent job with that, and we, we gave ourselves a chance at the end, so um, we just have to find a way to close it.